And now let's head back to Adler Planetarium where Susanna Song joins us with those building crowds out there. Good morning, Susanna. Good morning, Merce and Aaron. The party is just getting started here at the Planetarium. You can see behind me, the parking lot is packed with spectators enjoying activities and just hanging out leading up to the eclipse. But let me tell you, just past those trees is what seems like a never ending line to get to those coveted solar glasses. The first person in line got here at 3.30, waited six hours to get her free pair, and she wasn't alone. Hundreds of people showed up extra early. Now, this was the line around 9.30 when Adler finally started handing them out, at least a mile long. The line stretched past the shed, past Soldier Field, and curved around Museum Campus. They are giving out 30,000 pairs this morning. People were so excited when they finally got their hands on those glasses. It was fun to see their reaction as they tried them on, looked up at the sun, and just thrilled to be a part of this historic day. I think that's awesome. Like, it feels like unity. It feels nice. Like, definitely what Chicago needs. I've been looking the whole week. What is an eclipse? It's where the sun's in the sky and then the the moon is passing by and then it blocks the sun from bringing light to us. Good job. Where did you learn that? From school. A very smart boy indeed. Now, the Adler is calling today their Super Bowl. They will have activities all day, including live stream of the total eclipse from different locations throughout the country. Reporting live from the Adler, Susanna Song, CBS 2 News. All right, Susanna, thank you.